Let's rewind back to 2017. A mid-sized European frozen food company had built something remarkable. They weren't a household name, but inside the industry, they were a rising powerhouse. Their portfolio, frozen ready meals and vegetables shipped in high volumes across Europe, the Middle East, and Asia. Over 40 countries with dozens of retailers and most importantly, a loyal consumer base that loved their clean label, preservative-free approach. They built their reputation on the kind of things that actually matter behind the scenes. Rock solid cold chain management, top tier brand reputation through compliance global standards, also known as BRCGS, food safety ratings, and an unmatched track record for on-time delivery. On paper, everything looked airtight. Behind that success was a paper trail of trust, detailed HACCP plans, strict allergen control protocols, verified supplier audits, and stacks of export health certificates. Every compliance box was checked, every file was in place, and every audit passed with flying colors. But buried deep inside their quality system was a blind spot. The company had updated equipment, changed suppliers, and adjusted processes over time. But their hazard analysis plan? It was never updated to reflect those changes. The forgotten step, HACCP revalidation, in food safety, it's not always the big systems that fail, it's the small steps that get skipped. One of the most overlooked, yet critical, of those steps that they forgot was HACCP revalidation. It's not just paperwork, it's a formal review that asks one question. Does your food safety plan still protect against every known hazard, especially after changes in ingredients, equipment, or processes? 